subscribe and ring the bell to never miss an update. Today on Lady Mary Bath, we are back at MAM, one of our favorite charity resales in Houston, Texas. And we are here to see all of the new spring additions. They've cleared out the entire store over the weekend with a 50% off sale. The line was wrapped around the building and they have reset the store for a spring look. Come along for all the treasures. I know you've seen this wonderful shop in previous segments and you know all the different areas of the store with the furniture, the books, the clothing, table linens, but today we will focus on home and fashion and ways to add affordable items to give your home a refreshed and renewed look. For example, this dish for $5, it's originally from Sur La Table, made in Italy, and what a fantastic addition to your table. Let's take a look at some of the areas of the store. I often have to remind myself when I'm shopping an upscale charity resale that it's not a retail store. How quickly we forget everything is so beautifully merchandised, often by color and style. And I don't know about you, but when I go into box stores, I find that I am restless. It's not that impressive. Everything starts to look alike. And that's why I really love resale shopping. So let's take a look at some of their different displays today. You know, chinoiserie is my favorite design element. I feature this in my birthday party and is sort of new to me, although I did grow up with some of these pieces in my household. And if you look at period dramas or even current movies, take a look and you often see chinoiserie in the background as part of the landscape. It's not always blue and white. That's what this collection is here today and also my favorite. Look at this square footed chinoiserie piece. Isn't that gorgeous? I'm thinking you could put a plant, maybe a bunny, some colorful silk flowers, and really make a splash as a centerpiece. And this is a $3 item. It is a toothbrush holder. And that's a way to elevate your everyday. Keep this in the bathroom. And you could even use it as a vase that could be like a flower frog. Let's take a look at some of these beautiful pieces. Look at this cheese grater. Have you ever seen anything so interesting? It's six dollars. Wouldn't that be fun to add to your kitchen assortment? And this I saw in the case next to me and it's Blinko glass. That is a company that's been around for years and it's $10. I think these are usually about $50 on their website. So that's a really good deal. This vase would be a great statement piece to add to your home and it certainly will look great with silk or fresh florals. For $18, this is a steal. I wish I had found this when I was collecting chinoiserie for my birthday last summer. They have so many great items in this collection. I love the yellow. It's like bringing a ray of sunshine inside and it pairs well with so many different colors and sunflowers are so popular. Lots of different areas here, cubbies and things that you could possibly overlook. Yellow is a popular color in the 70s and I think it's making a great comeback. Here they've got a nice collection and some Fitz and Floyd plates. You can add that to a white dinner service or for tea time. And this cabbage look is definitely coming back as well. You see that at Sur La Table and some of the other high-end retail stores. And everyone loves sunflowers. It's definitely a sunny and cheery look. I like the daring addition of the outdoor yard art blowfish to the tableware here. It's definitely coordinating well with the yellow and the other pops of color. They do such a good job of the displays here and I could see that in a living room. Blue is a soothing color and perfect for all seasons. We've got some great examples here with pops of color. This vintage chip and dip set I think could be used separately or together for so many different purposes. And it looks to be an older piece. It's a set of two for $12. Isn't that a great deal? And another thing that catches my eye here, they have a set of four plateaus. You could nestle a bowl inside of this and there's an original price tag of $100 and they're $6 each. Isn't that fabulous? And those pedestal pieces sold very quickly. I turned around and they were gone. Look at this refreshing pattern. Let's take a closer look at this. Something that 
I've never seen before. It's always exciting to find a new vintage pattern. This is made by the Denby Company, and it's actually made in Portugal. It's got a really nice back stamp. It is fine china with the lemon and lime colors. It's perfect for spring, and it definitely segues into summer as well. And that can even be paired with a more modern day made in China ceramic planter. Love the dragonfly detail, and it is $5. I can see this pattern with so many different styles. You don't have to have necessarily a traditional or a modern home for this. I think it stands alone and some great colors that you could pair with that. This is a great extensive collection of this vintage Denby. And I love that they don't have a finial on the teapot or sugar bowl, but you simply place your fingers inside and lift up the lid. It's very practical. Isn't that fun? I wonder if that will ever come back into modern day China. And here are some of our traditional pastels for Easter and spring. And I like that they pair non-table essentials here with the lamp and the mirror. And if I had this set, I think I might use them separately so that it would really pop on a table. Nothing says spring like a new tea set. Isn't this fun? These are like flowers and petals from the Bombay Company and it's complete with teapot, sugar and creamer and lots of accessories. Wouldn't that be fun for a little girl's tea party? And they've got some great accessories here too with the rose topiary. They even have a beautiful lamp here and it's only $20. That's a great affordable way to dress up your home for this season. I always look forward to their showcases. They have a very interesting pattern each time that I'm here. The last visit, it was Autumn by Lennox. And this is a Limoges pattern, Louvier, made by Renault. And it's definitely something that I haven't seen before and would not add interest to your dinner party for your guests to wonder. And I love this set of bisque porcelain planters. My friend Lydia spotted these two lovely vase planters in the case, and you could fill that with some silks, fresh florals, lots of detail. These are hand painted in Japan. Aren't they lovely? And a matching pair would be beautiful on a table. It's always fun to be back at the Mam Boutique. I found some wonderful clothes and accessories here over the years, including handbags. And it feels like a personal shopping experience. They have a separate location in the back of the store and it's such fun. This dress here is striking. I would like to turn that into a tablecloth. Look at the birds and the florals. And it's an Eliza J and wait for it. Let's look at the second tag. It's from Nordstrom, brand new. Here's that 70s vibe with the lemon yellow and it's priced at $16.99. Definitely affordable fashion here at the Mam Boutique. They do have clothing in another part of the store, but I tend to gravitate towards the boutique. I just like that whole shopping experience. $29.99, that is a lovely dress off the shoulder. Shopping resale is always a good idea for fashion. It's more affordable, you get top labels, and you never show up at a wedding where someone else is wearing your dress. That has actually happened to me. Uh, the pants I'm wearing today are Secret Olsen. They are silk, and they're from my neighborhood Goodwill store. So you can see that I definitely wear fashion from the secondary market. And look at these gorgeous dresses. I'm going to look around the store today to see what I find to try on and share with you. I've looked at the boutique and I found some dresses that I'm going to try on. So stay tuned. We'll see how they all look. You know, I love blue and white, and this has an interesting pattern to it. And it's a brand that I'm very familiar with. It's easy care, great for traveling. You don't have to worry about wrinkles. And I certainly love that look for Texas summers. This is a nice dress. It's not exactly my style. I do like the warm colors, but I'll probably pass on this one. This is a reliable classic look, but I'm really looking for a pop of color for the spring and summer, and I think I'll pass on this classic look. It's a bit drab. Can you see it in my face? I'm not that excited. And this dress is very comfortable. It kind of looks like stained glass, doesn't it? Like a rosette window. You know, I do like the blue, but I'm not sure that it's me. And this dress is definitely thinking outside of the box for me, but I do like it. 
I can see that for poolside, summer parties that are casual, but yet you want to make a statement. And so many colors here for accessories, but I think I might just stick with some neutrals, neutral shoes and handbag. This is a cute dress for running around town. I don't usually have a lot of sleeveless in my wardrobe, but I do like it and that's a great pattern. Wouldn't that be nice in a tablecloth? Such pretty colors. All right, here are my two choices. I tried on lots and lots of dresses. That's something I wanted to add to my spring wardrobe. And I found something with lots of color and the classic blue and white. This is a Jude Connolly here and I love the material. It's almost like a scuba. It's $16.99 and these usually sell for over $100. So that's a great deal. And this one just says absolutely nothing on the label except the size. And I'm imagining someone brought this back from an exotic vacation. Just when I thought I had seen everything in the store, they brought out this Brooks Brothers gingham dress with a bit of a retro look. And for $19.99, I'm definitely taking this home. I can see this for a summer or spring party and even just everyday shopping around town. Really happy to have this dress. And I also found some shoes to go with it. These are a European size, they're white. They would be perfect for spring and summer. They have great accessories here in the boutique. This is a cabbie belt. Cabbie, I do wear a lot. In fact, this shirt is also from cabbie. And it's Carol Anderson by invitation. These are sold by independent distributors. This is a $68 belt and it is listed for $24.99. And that's really a good deal. And what a gorgeous accessory to add to your wardrobe. They have lovely handbags and accessories here in the boutique. This is the Stuart Weitzman handbag, and I featured this in a previous segment. It is still here. It's the Rockette bag, originally priced $320. It's $125. Wouldn't that be perfect with your spring wardrobe? Great for an event or a wedding. And the Mary Frances handbag caught my eye. This is one of the older pieces. I have quite a collection of Mary Frances. My stepmother does as well. Maybe I'll feature that at some point. This is $125. And a Kate Spade backpack would, would be great for traveling. And I'm liking these Jimmy Choo shoes. Wouldn't that be the perfect statement for spring? I love that lime green. And they're $60. And there's another handbag I found in another section of the store here in the boutique. It is a Radley. I'm not very familiar with the brand, but this looks like it'd be great for travel as well. It's got a cute logo and it is priced. 125 pounds or 145 euros which is about 165 dollars and it's 79.99 and i think this would be a great crossbody for travel and that's something that i'm thinking about today a wonderful quality leather i can't tell you how much i enjoyed that handbag taking it all over europe through paris luxembourg germany and now i want it in every color speaking of color there's some beautiful florals here but first let's take a look at the brass scales have a friend who collects these for 10 to 15 dollars you could take some spring silk florals home they've got a great selection over here behind me and if you want a ready-made container here they've got this what a beautiful design with the bird and this is twenty dollars you can't go to the hobby lobby and get that and make it for twenty dollars and it's not all about florals they do have a beautiful crystal accent bowl this is wedgwood crystal and it is twelve dollars that'd be a great addition to your tea table and also makes a great gift don't forget when you're shopping resale that you can think about upcoming gift needs that you have and here is a crystal box that's in the shape of an egg isn't that gorgeous it's ten dollars they have some amazing deals here today it seems like we're in a european flower market here the way they present everything so beautifully you almost think the silks are fresh flowers i did get those ranunculus you may have seen me feature those in my easter segment they were in that 18 dollars chinoiserie vase on my buffet this bunny planter for three dollars would be a great hostess gift put a plant inside and that's a very affordable gift this hand-painted cookie jar is really interesting it's a field of flowers here i found some more this is only four dollars look at these hyacinths they really do have some great prices and I found some wonderful Easter items here as well. My friend is getting this ceramic bunny. It's only $4 and look how you can dress that up. You could either put some flowers 
a little garland or some French ribbon as this is. I love wired French ribbon. And what a wonderful addition to your Easter or spring table. And this one is interesting. I wanted to point this out. It's actually a bowling pin that has been made into a rabbit. Look at that. That's something I've never seen before. Lots of great finds here today. And I always look for some of the vintage and antique pieces. That picture is really interesting. And some teacups and saucers with trios. That's with a dessert plate. And that's popular in Canada and probably Australia and definitely the UK. And lots of unique pieces here that might have been brought back from someone's travels. $8 and yes, that price does come off with a little soap and water. I hope that you have some teacups in your collection. If not, this is always a good opportunity when you're at a charity resale to start a collection. And this is only $5 for the cup and saucer. Beautiful back stamp, Royal Imperial Made in England. And that is perfect for spring. And if you only have room for one in your cabinet, you can definitely fill this with fresh flowers, take it to your florist, and you can have a wonderful accent to your tea table. Also makes a great Mother's Day gift. Keep that in mind. And this is a lovely picture. This is vintage. It's from Germany. It's got a beautiful back stamp on it. It's only $6. And that could be a really nice picture or use it as a vase for flowers. And the trios, you probably have heard of these in Canada and in Germany. They often have a set of three. The dessert plate and the cup and saucer. My friend Lydia is picking this up today. It's got beautiful violets. Isn't that a gorgeous pattern? And even inside the cup, it has detailing. And it's $5 for the set. And it is Sweet Violet Royal Albert, made in England. What a lovely addition that will be to her tea table. And traditionally, I think that they set these with many different patterns. It wasn't all one. And here's another example of that. It's a lovely set. Isn't that gorgeous? And having filmed recently at China Baroque, I can see some beautiful jewelry made of these. And this is Coalport. Fragrance is the pattern. This was a company later acquired by Wedgwood. You might recognize this pattern. It is Desert Rose from Franciscan. And companies would contract a glass company, perhaps the Libby Glass Company, to make glasses that coordinate with their china patterns. I've never seen so many desert rose glasses in one place. This is a pattern that was started by a Franciscan in California years ago. My mother had Franciscan ivy and the desert rose. And this was made by a different company in honor of the pattern. These are $3 each, tumblers and goblets. It'd be great for iced tea and then you could serve maybe something special. It doesn't have to be wine, it could even be a dessert. Imagine a fruit salad on top of a beautiful plate your desert rose pattern. Wouldn't that be great? Even with white dishes. What a wonderful find this is today. Oh, my mother would have so enjoyed having all of these glasses to go with her pattern. And I'm sure those sold very quickly. At $3 a piece, that is a bargain. They get a lot of estate sale donations in this area, so you never know what you will find. And that's why we do have a lot of vintage items that show up. And a very familiar pattern that I will tell you about with a classic blue and white and a touch of green. And lots of baking dishes. I love when I find things that have been repurposed. This was either a votive holder or a sugar bowl and they have placed orchids inside. For $6, this would be a great addition to maybe a bookshelf, an area in your home, perhaps a side table in your living room that needs a little something and it adds some height as well. The Villarine Box Switch 3 pattern, what a wonderful surprise. I have a friend that collects this. It started in the 90s and it is still a popular pattern today. And these are priced individually. This is $6 for the sugar bowl and a casserole dish, which I think is so purposeful. I have this in white from Villarine Box. This is $25, and this is great for so many purposes. It's wonderful to find the Switch 3. I love cart diving, and of course, I have to take a look at the new items that are about to hit the floor. A pair of ceramic ducks for $10. You never know when that will fit with a certain table decor. And I've started collecting swans recently and lucky enough to find a pair here. They're very graceful. 
I plan to put these on my mirrored tray on my coffee table. Made in Japan, the small one is $6. And the larger one I think is $8. And that definitely would add some beauty and elegance to my display. That's a nice planter if you're invited somewhere for Easter and $6. You really can't beat the prices at a charity resale. Retail stores just cannot compete with the quality, style, and affordability. This is a specific collection made in Germany. There was a customer that got these as soon as they were put out. Not sure if this egg is maybe handmade. It's very intricate and unusual. And definitely the price uh, goes with the uniqueness. Another peek at this Denby pottery. I think that's just something so refreshing for this season with the luscious lime and lemon colors. I've never seen that pattern, which makes it so unique and special. You never know what you'll find when you dig deep or you go down really low. I'm looking at these cabinets that I didn't see at first glance. This is an Avon dish. Isn't that perfect for spring? It's got a cute duck here and it looks like morning glories. And this is $6. Isn't that fantastic? You could actually put food on that. It is food safe. And from William Sonoma, look at these egg dishes. It'd be great for a dessert, even just strawberries and cream. It's originally priced $39. I don't see the price right now, but I'm sure it's probably under $10. And William Sonoma, that would be a great giftable too because it's in the original box. It is egg shaped as well. These are from Tag and these dishes are two dollars each it's a great plate for tapas or even for just maybe a cookie if you're serving a quick dessert and they come in four different colors they have a lovely seasonal section that represents just about every holiday including christmas in the corner and here we've got some easter items that you could add to your decor or maybe even give as a hostess gift if you're invited to a party look at that what a great dish that is. You could put that on an easel. It could be part of your buffet display or you could serve sweets on it. Who needs a box store when you can shop at Charity Resale and find beautiful items for your seasonal decor? Look what I found hiding in the bunny patch. This reminds me a bit of my chinoiserie collection because it is blue and white, but it does not have any of the Eastern elements. $4.50. This is definitely gonna go home with me and some other really great items for $12. This could be the start of a centerpiece project for you. You can embellish it. You could add some maybe crystal candle holders and bowls and vases amongst this, build it up and make it a stunning centerpiece. And this is sort of a nod to the old style look here. It's $2.50. You can't go wrong with that, just to add a touch of Easter. And my friend is grabbing this today. It is a little project where you can hang these ornaments on the tree, and it is $3. That is a fantastic deal. And the other item I wanted to highlight is this beaded box. And for $2, wouldn't that be great to hide an Easter gift inside or add it to your decor? Remember that blue bunny? A viewer saw that in my Easter display and suggested that that could be from the Dedham, Massachusetts Pottery Company, and it certainly is. I appreciate her pointing that out, and I sure enjoy displaying that for Easter. And some St. Patty's Day items. This is a cupcake holder, but I could also see maybe some figurines, something unique displayed there for a centerpiece if you're having an event. And this you could actually fill with white carnations. It's a little cheesy and why not? For $1.50, that could be a very simple centerpiece for a festive event. This is quite a find today, especially for St. Patrick's Day and all of spring. These are placemats and napkins. And I have to say, it's really hard to find with shamrocks and they're only $5 for a set of four. And for $10, you could have enough for eight place settings. What a wonderful set that is. And look at this Irish dancer. It's almost like a nutcracker, but not quite. It is wooden. It's $6.50. And look at that detail here on bottom. She is standing on a shamrock. And it is from the Nutcracker Village from 2005. You see Christmas there in the background? Yes, they are spreading the joy all year round. 
and they have some great decor for your front door or if you're a teacher maybe you could even find some things to add to your classroom this reminds me of the plastic grid that I think my mother would embroider in the 1970s that looks to be vintage and it's a dollar fifty you can incorporate that into a wreath and here are some baskets Easter grass eggs and really again another reason to not have to shop retail for seasonal and they even have Easter egg dye kits and a lot of times kids don't keep their baskets long anyway so definitely save some money and thrift those items here's a handmade Easter basket that is really a neat piece and the price is right three dollars and fifty cents very sweet and let's go back and look in the cases now that they have put some of these items out there's that fabulous egg quite intricate looks like a bunny configuring next to it I found some Limoges boxes and other treasures here over the years and even recently I'm so glad you came along with me today to MAM Resale. They have so many wonderful additions to your spring home and wardrobe here at Memorial Assistance Ministries. And they just put some bunny plates out. Aren't these lovely? They pair nicely with this pattern. Thanks again for joining Lady Mary Beth. Elevate your everyday with resale shopping.